today's video, I'm going to be talking about the integrated uh, national boards. I have already uploaded um, two videos about both MPTE part one and two. So uh, that was actually about three years ago. So this is more of an updated version to uh, the previous exams. I I just want to say that this uh, the information that I'm going to be providing is actually not just for me, but I also asked some of my friends uh, that have been through the IMBDE and that passed the exam, and that's how I kind of gathered information gathered information from all of them. Um, so I'm going to be sharing their tips, my tips, and um, the study material that they used to pass the exam. Uh, if you have this exam, good luck. I hope this video is helpful and please keep watching. Okay, so to start with, I prefer starting with dental decks just because they are cards, they are more focused. Um, you don't spend so much time reading through the cards, so it kind of motivates you to read more. However, I think the problem with dental decks is that, like for me, I'm used to reading in books and reading more of a background background information so that was the main reason why i would prefer reading a book in addition to the dental decks uh you can read your mbde you have you actually would have to read your mbde part one and two dental decks for the integrated national boards so uh the books uh that i would recommend is two types of book the first book is going to be a book about basic science and then the second book would be a book about uh, clinical dentistry so I'm going to start with clinical dentistry just because it's uh, easier um, for clinical dentistry I would highly recommend Mosby I feel that uh, Mosby is a very good book even during like my bench exams and when I whenever I needed to study about treatment plans about um, just anything clinically, I would go back to Mosby. Uh, the information are presented easily. You can just easily find whatever you are looking for. And I just like the way the book is written. And also it has everything. So I feel that Mosby would be a great combination to the Daniel Dex. For the basic science, um, so there are different books that you can use for basic science. There is a Kaplan, there is First Aid, there is, um, I believe Mosby also has one for basic science, but I'm not sure about that. But um, for me, I think First Aid was the best one. Um, and I did recommend it when I uh, filmed my video about the MBDE part one. Uh, it was also focused uh, and it had all the information that I needed that helped me understand more uh, dental decks. So those cards along with Mosby and First Aid will be very helpful for you to pass the IMBDE. Now, uh, the third thing that you would need is I would suggest going through the ASDA questions. Now, this is more of a, um, like a conflict now a lot of people are saying that you don't have to go through as the questions just because that's the main reason imbde was made but um for me i think that going through the as the questions would actually be helpful um at the end of the day you're reading questions you are going to have an exam about that is combi combined of both mbde part one and two so it's also helpful to read questions uh, like previous questions from previous years about those exams even though they were separated and they were not combined and whenever like you find a question that you're not so sure about you can go back to your material go back to um, the books or go back to your dental decks and then find out more about that information so it's always helpful to read questions um, I would also uh, point out to um, watching watch for the facebook groups uh i feel that nowadays people are more open uh, for like sharing information and some of them really share important tips so make sure you follow like the uh, facebook pages for the imbde or mbde part two or one or whatever before going to take the exam because that those are extremely helpful don't focus too much on the questions sometimes people give like wrong answers and they may confuse you even more whenever there is a question you don't know just go back to your 
previous material and uh, you can find out more about it instead of actually depending on the people commenting. But you can use that for maybe notes or files that they put on these Facebook, Facebook groups. Make sure you check them out because they always have some useful information um, included in, in those groups. Um, I have many friends that also used uh, apps for uh, the MBDEs and I think they are helpful, but I, for me personally, I didn't use them. I know a lot of people that didn't use them as well, so it actually just depends on you if you have the time. But uh, the most important things to read for these exams are going to be your uh, dental Dex cards, your uh, first aid book if you have it, or any other book that will provide you with information about basic science, um, and any book that will provide you information about clinical dentistry, which I suggest must be. Uh, and as I hope that this video was helpful. And if you have been to the exam and if you use my video and if you went to the exam and uh, scored a, like a passed the exam and you think that this video helped you doing that, please leave a comment below just so that other people would um, benefit from that. And also if you think that there's something missing about this video or there is like a book I didn't mention and most people are you know benefiting from please also leave a comment because it will help other people and as always thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you next time